Hello everyone, this is JLS1114. For those of you who've been watching my videos, you know by now that I'm legally blind. You also would know that I have scoliosis. I recently made an in-depth video about that, but though I may have mentioned in a couple of videos that I'm legally blind, I didn't really explain that too well. So I am now in this video. First, what you should know, that I've also mentioned in previous videos, but I'm going to mention this again, for those who, this could be their first video, or they just haven't caught those videos, um, I'm blind in my left eye, I only can see shadows and light, that's it, in my right eye, I can only see two feet in front of me. That's with my glasses, by the way. Um, things are blurry to me without them. Um, so, um, what causes this, my visual impairness, you should say, is I have glaucoma, which damages the retina, which is the back of the eye. Now, I've heard a lot of people say to me, <clears throat> don't worry, you'll get your vision back one day. No, I would like to believe that, but I live in the real world, <laughs> you know, and I know it won't happen for one reason. This disease once vision any uh, anything with the eye is damaged it's gone forever unfortunately with this disease it only can get worse not better I'm actually expected to lose all my vision at one at one point in time in my life um, hoping it doesn't happen, but it's expected to happen. I've been told this and known it for years, so I won't be surprised, but uh, I don't know how good I can deal with that. I don't even like thinking about it, but um, you know, that's the real world. Gotta face truth. Um, so, yeah, it can only get worse, not better. There are so many several, several, several eye diseases out there and some I know some people who they were really bad when they were younger and when they got older they got better but not in my case unfortunately so yeah so that's definitely first and foremost it only can get worse not better um, I have had 13 surgeries on my eyes and for those who didn't see my scoliosis video, I've had eight on my back. So, I'm pretty much a pro when it comes to surgeries. Not something I'm proud of, and I'm not a fan of them, but hey. Um, so, yep, 13 on my eyes. Um, basically, before I go a little more into that actually, Glaucoma, you play a pressure game. Now you think fun or whatever. What I mean is, there's pressure in the eye that can build up. And it's basically what glaucoma is all about. There's machines that check the pressure of my eye. And if it's about the low teens to low 20s that's good if that's some um, that's really good that's, that's really good but if it's below the teens that's not good the trick is with glaucoma is it can make the pressure fluctuate fluctuate and you don't want it too low and you don't want it too high too low would be 
below the the teens. Except for like nine, ten, but lower lower than that is not good. It's way too low. And that's not good. Too high would be mid twenties and higher. And this, if it's not controlled and brought down real quick, it can do further damage to your eye. It, which can cause pain if it goes too high. I actually even heard if it stays a constant problem, it can even shrivel your eye. Um, so, to control this, they have drops, and I have been probably on everyone that's out there for glaucoma. And on top of that, I take a pill as well. So, right now I take a pill and a drop, but I've been a walking drugstore. I'm taking like three drops at a time and the pill. So, <laughs> but right now, luckily, I'm only on one drop and one pill four times a day. I'll probably have to take them for the rest of my life because you can't play. Glaucoma tends to play around with the pressure, so, and you have to keep it down. Not too down, like I said, but down. So, that's what that involves, glaucoma, basically. Um, very frustrating, but, yeah, so I have to constantly get it checked and stay up on it. Now, back to the surgery thing real quick. Um, like I said, I had 13 surgeries. The last one I had is what I want to talk about. The last one I had, uh, a valve was put in my eye to keep the pressure down because we were having a pressure problem. Yeah, if it can't get controlled, by the way, from the medicine, that's when they take the surgery route. Well, we are having a huge problem with my pressure. And so we put a valve in my eye, which is a tube, and it's right, you can't see it, but it's, I was, I'm told it's right, pretty much right in the front of my eye, if with the machine, they can see it real quick, right in the front of my right eye. Um, and, uh, it's been working. I don't really understand how it works, but, uh, it's keeping the pressure down. I have actually been one of the most successful cases for the longest time with this surgery. Not too many people have done it and some and some people has failed. It been in me I found out for ten years. So. Yep. So hopefully that will continue to go well. So anyway that's basically uh, an overview of what I have and what it's about. Text and video comments are definitely welcome. And questions, feel free. Thanks, have a nice day.